But that area of the country, which is called Tornado Alley, is more prone to twisters than any other region on Earth because that is where warm and cold air collide. Mm -hmm. Day in and day out, you see it in this time of year. 10 on your side, Chief Meteorologist Don Slater can explain it best, though. Don? Yeah, uh, take a look at what's going on with that. Really, they're very close to the Gulf of Mexico. Uh, they've got air coming in off of the continent, and that colder air with the jet stream, uh, again, with all of that, that drops on in and uh, meets up with that humid air coming right on in, that buoyant air coming in off of the Gulf of Mexico. And when that happens, kaboom. Plus, you had some drier uh, coming in off of uh, Mexico as well. So, again, it's a clash of all kinds of air masses. And you can see right now that there's a 30 degree temperature difference from Austin, Texas uh, to Oklahoma City. And that's what happened yesterday. That clash of air masses moved on in. And you can see where the warning still, or at least the watches still are, those boxes, the red ones for tornado watches, uh, still in effect. But again, everything's a little more quiet for today. It's all of the northeast of the Dallas Fort Worth area. We've got some scattered showers and some thunderstorms into our area, and the threat has shifted for them. But for us, a few storms, nothing too terribly strong right now. There's Super Number 10 Live. We'll be back and show you that. That'll be coming up in just a few minutes.